In this video, I tested out a new headset. If you notice a difference and you don't like it, let me know. Alright, bye! Welcome to the next episode of Fallout 4. How are you all doing? So, apparently I got approached by, um, Piper for a second there. Uh, let's go talk to her. Hey. Where to? Hey, Piper. Always on good behavior, aren't you? I tried to be. Seems like you're doing better than trying. I appreciate it. Too few folks can be bothered. Of course, in my experience, if you want to do real good, playing nice only gets you so far. I mean, look at Diamond City, a place I've been trying to warn of real danger. But every issue I publish, all I hear is, oh, Piper, why don't you ever publish anything happy? Piper, why can't you write something what? nice for a change? What? It's enough to make me want to hang up my hat some days. Fucking retards! Is this we happy for you all over again? No, no! Stop ignoring the truth, you fuckwads! Stop ignoring the ugly truth! Yoo-hoo. Sounds like it must be exhausting. Huh, no kidding. But people, <laughs> they deserve to know the truth. I can't I'm have sure my own time. Knowing what's really out there. Night doesn't go by, I'm not afraid. Some institute drone will decide. Today's the day to pay old Piper and family a visit. Ah, I hate that noise. Because I know the truth. That's what protects us. Um. Couldn't agree more. Absolutely. Couldn't agree more. How can you protect you and yours if you don't know what you're facing? Exactly. Most folks, though, they'd prefer a comforting lie. Not me. I've seen firsthand what the truth can do. My sister and I, we grew up way out in the Commonwealth. Tiny little settlement. Our dad, he was part hell? of the local militia. <laughs> Keeping the raiders off our backs and the Mirelurks out of our latrines, as he'd describe it. Well, uh, one day, our dad turns up dead. His captain, asshole named Mayburn, Claims raiders must have gotten him on watch. Well, I didn't buy it. I start making inquiries. Turns out, Captain, he'd sold out. Thought he wasn't getting paid enough to babysit the town. He was gonna leave the gates open one night. Let a group of raiders sack the place and take a cut of the profits. My dad found out and was gonna turn Mayburn in, but Mayburn got to him first. And I wasn't about to let that bastard get away with murder. I tried talking to the mayor, but he wouldn't listen. So... I papered the entire town in posters. Wanted for gross dereliction of duty, Captain Mayburn. The mayor sure wanted to talk after that. <laughs> the town threw Mayburn out on his ass and were dug in when a very surprised group of raiders finally showed. Sorry about your dad. What happened then? I'm sorry about your dad. Thanks. It was hard after he was gone, but knowing that he died doing right, that's always made it easier. But hey, I... I'm sorry if I've been rambling. I just get fired up sometimes. Hey, it's I understand. It's nice to talk to someone who, who actually seems to get it, you know? I get it. So, should yeah. we head out? Eh. You, you just... Thank you. Very like it's like I can finally think straight. And there's this guy. And welcome to this playthrough of Fallout 4. 
As you can see, I have a security camera here and uh, all over here. This place is heavily on powered. See? Requires power. Why? Because it requires copper. Why do I need copper? Because copper makes power generators. Why do you need a power generator? Because I need power. What for? Oh, I need power to uh, use the security cameras. But they're down. Why do you want to do that? Because I want to see my other settlements via camera feed. You can do that? Yes. You being an asshole. I know. I know. There's dice. <clears throat> and dice is literally a lovable character. Even now I want to, like, be him. You know how um, amazing it is to be a dice? It's fucking amazing. Oh great, this is a super mutant. Die, you super mutants! You don't want to be near those when you're outside power the armor. Those things hurt. Stop right there! Hey, by the way, can you do something for me, you stupid super mutant that likes to do things? Oh wait, I don't have you on insight. Never mind then. Let me meet. You can hound me. I'll take your dog bowl because you're dead. You don't need it anymore, you're dead. You're right. You're also right on that too. Apparently, the super mutants allow themselves to talk fucking retardedly because their brains are a little radioactive. Like, Mutated brains are kind of uh, a big deal. 36% to steal. Can't steal it. Time to shoot you in the back of the head. Uh, left, left. Ah, yeah, you're right about game being over. You're dead now. Hey, Piper. How you doing, Piper? You doing good, Piper? I need to return to Aeris McMcNeagle. Aeris McMcNeagle has something I like. I like it. I like it a lot. Aeris McMcNeagle. I am a humorous person. If I don't do anything about my Aeris McMcNeagle, or what 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 do they call it? Uh, what do they call Aeris McMcNeagle? Egret Tours Marina. Close enough. Egret. Two years and moon. I'm gonna just call it Old Aggret. Hey, Old Aggret. Uh, offensive? I didn't think it was offensive. Fine, I'll just call it Aggret. Aggret. No offense, but you smell like an old person. We're doing a Let's Play series. Not a playthrough. Remember this, kids. Playthroughs and Let's... What the hell is that thing? Oh yeah, I found one of those. Never mind. Nah, this is our story, boys. We're starting fresh, and now we're on episode two. And enjoy the ugly looks of this creature. I, I and I welcome to my uh, wares. This is me actually recording with the recording button, and I hope it doesn't give me double audio. I'll check if it does. But this is my armor stand, and notice one of them is. Missing armor! That is the armor I'm wearing. Now let's get naked. This is my silver shroud outfit. This is my mechanist outfit. They actually do matter in their own way. The silver shroud, you play as a superhero that sh kills villains. The mechanist is a drawing that has been brought to life by the real mechanist. Oh, you notice that uh, I have this. Most people are good at breaking. Yeah, I even have a sword. Look. Where is it? 
Oh, I have it. Notice the details of this sword. Notice how relevant it is to another game. What game is it? Oh, uh, uh, Skyrim. Why well, you have a Skyrim sword and a Skyrim hat? Are you modding? No. It's buyable. It's not a mod, it's buyable. It comes with the creation club. I don't know why games do this, but they create clubs. Heads up. You deserve a teddy bear, my dear. Teddy bears are great, aren't they? Whoa! Whoa! There we go. Enjoy the teddy bear. But I want my press hat and my coat back. Uh... Let's see if I uh, can create something in place of your old memory. Display, 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 female. We got a female display, right? Yes, um, <clears throat> let's put it, like, right here. That's a good spot. You just have the mannequin in a wall, and, uh, you, you micromanage it to get in the wall further, and make more room. Yeah. You doing a good job, Armor Rack. You keeping a memory alive. Boom. Uh, trench coat. Boom. This is, uh, Piper's out there. There you go, Piper. I, I put your suit over there. Home, sweet home. Because it's a home, it's home, sweet home. I really don't like you standing in front of me. Because my home is not there. I hear that you get a trophy for doing this. I actually want to do it though. Boom. Ah. Who's been a bad boy? Oh, a stranger, huh? Come with me, stranger. I have a thing for you. Time out for ye. Oh, by the way. Hey, it's Senti. Senti, 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 Senti. Hey, Senti. Hey, how are you doing? You're looking beautiful. This is my um, additional companion. You can have and now an additional companion. So, uh, if we had to, we can turn uh, on. Senti is alive. Senti is questionable, but she's alive. Human on deck. Attention. You have to hack her to give her orders. That's just odd, isn't it? If only I had like that special hacking angle. So I don't have to be up in her face all the time. So, uh, what happens to a guy when he's, um, find on the pillory, huh? No, I don't care. And why is that? Uh, never mind. They're doing jack and weird stuff over there. And I'm just being like a guy who just watches a person. Hey, how you doing? I just want to trade a few things. Sure thing. Why are you in the pillory? That's so funny. But I digress. Uh, you don't need to be in the pillory anymore. Just go. The pillories are awful. Am I right, sir? I don't even know where um, my pink tank is. I signed her somewhere and I lost her. By the way, Codsworth is a woman now. Say hi, Codsworth. Codsworth. May I accompany you, sir? Not now, Codsworth. I see, sir. Another time, then. Congratulations, Codsworth. You come with me. Hey, Codsworth. May I accompany you, sir? Come with me, you sexy man. Yes. And Piper, you're going to... I don't know where you're going, but you're going to Sanctuary Hills. Is that all right? Good. I don't even know where um, Ada is. Ada, where are oh, you? I... Hey, it's my pink tank! Pink tank! Hey guys, it's pink tank! Oh, pink tank. Pink tank! 
That's good going. Excellent. I'll endeavor to do my best. Why are you farting so much? Stop making noise. You want the enemy to know we're here? Oh no. Oh Jesus. Calm down. Oh God. That was, um, good job, my beautiful battle tank. I didn't expect... Oh, Jesus. I think you're overdoing it with those missiles, lady. Don't blow us up, Jesus. Uh... Uh, I don't see them. I see you being scary as hell, though. Keep your guard up. She's dangerous. Calm down. Mamma mia! Stop doing that. Just get the crap out of me. So. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Calm down. Yay! You're pacified. You piece of crap. You know, if only you knew better, right? Stop right there. Uh, I suggest you walk the other way, guys. Please walk the other way. I don't want to hurt you. Look, you shouldn't be here. You really shouldn't. Do not mean that you should be worried about. I'm worried about you, though. Your companion does more damage, but cannot hurt you. You know that that does feel comforting. Shoot! Here we go then. Look at that. That's a car. And an enemy. Down. Nice! Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. You... Jesus, did you use irradiation damage? Oh my god. You got some bottle caps. I might need some bottle caps. Not some tin cans. Where are we going? That way. That's where we're going. You know the way. If only even Knuckle has that to guide them. But Knuckles doesn't have a way. So he tries to find it by himself. No, he always asks someone else for help because he can't do it by himself. Oh no, it's a gutsy. Yeah, mine. Yes. There you go, Mr. Gutsy. You're fighting for me, no? No, you don't come after me. You're fighting for me. Uh, that was amusing. Wobble brain, wobble brain, wobble brain. I like wobble brains. Jesus. This is what you get when you give her that kind of tussle. GG. Oh, killing me, Lisa. Hey, two enemies in the head uh, with red blips. Three enemies with red blips. Hey, uh, what's that all? Neat, neat. And boom. Shoot. A volley at him. Do you? No. Get down. Woo! 
Yeah, the leg is. Oh, wait, where's your lane? How dare they do this to Ava? How dare they? My box some robot tank. My pink tank. How dare they? Oh, I'm gonna kill you! Yes. Hey. Now give me this, this, uh, level thing. Boom. Get mine now. Boom. Oh, you're scared? That's intimidatingly interesting. Oh, run away! Oh, oh, I hit like a red roach, then meet Ada then. She hits like a freaking tank. How dare they do this to Ava? How dare they? My box some robot tank. My pink tank.